I'm gonna be making a classic Spanish frittata today. So I've got some onion, some bell pepper, some chorizo, and uh, some cooked potato. It's gonna dice up the mushrooms here. And um, what we're gonna do is we're just gonna cook it all together, put the egg in and then bake it in the oven. So just give your mushrooms and everything, just a rough chop. It's about a just quarter of them, depending on the size. So next we're just gonna uh, chop up the uh, pre-cooked potatoes into a you know, medium-sized dice. You can keep the skins on there because there are uh, lots of nutrients in there and, and uh, no sense in wasting. So just a nice chunky dice. Okay, so now for the frittata. First step, we're going to uh, just brown off the potatoes. So I just get a nice uh, oven-proof pan, like a cast iron pan or a sautoir on the heat and uh, some olive oil. Okay, so now that the potatoes are nice and golden, I'm just going to add in some onion. Just a touch more oil here. Some salt. And some pepper. Just going to add some paprika now. Mushrooms go in. Red bell pepper and the Spanish chorizo. Let that cook down for another five minutes. Just take your eggs. I got a dozen eggs here. Just whisk them up. A little bit of salt. And then just right in there, right on top of everything. I like to give it a little stir just to get the eggs in the bottom to scramble up and set so that it doesn't stick. Top it with some Moshego cheese and some chives. And then put that right into a 400 degree oven for about 20 minutes. So now it's been about 20 minutes and the frittata is now absolutely beautiful. All the cheese is nicely caramelized on top. The egg is cooked through. So now just let it sit for about five or 10 minutes and then cut and serve. And there you have it, traditional Spanish frittata.